Hey guys! You may remember this Fanimation Islander from previous videos. It had the big round oval blades that were in rough shape. Uh, and so I went, on, I went online and uh, ordered some replacement blades for it. I did not know they had a, uh, I think this is a 44 inch fan option with uh, 18 inch blades. Um, so that's pretty cool. I didn't know they had a smaller one and so I'm, I'm very excited about that. And uh, we're going to try it here. We got the original three speed control. We got some different controls. So let's start out. Well, already it goes quite fast compared to how it did with the big blades. And uh, 0.23. I don't remember what it was with the big blades on low. It was in that neighborhood. And if uh, you can always reference my other video. By the way, Andy's still here. He's filming his own video, which will be much better than mine. Except his has ladder bumps. Okay, that's low. Medium. 0.48. You have a bit of a rustling sound. Yeah. But quite a bit of a breeze from it, too, though. Much more than I would have expected. Definitely more than the, the wide blades. And I think we'll get even more rustling sound on high. Yep, there it is. Indeed. Okay. 0.68 on high. That's about what it was before, I think. Due to the material and construction of the blades, a rustling sound may be present. Indeed, one is. Yeah. It's, it's, a, it's supposed to be a relaxing, peaceful rustling sound. There's not a huge difference in airflow between medium and high, surprisingly. Even though there's a big difference in, in what I noticed from the uh, visual speed of it. If I go back here... I am not expecting to be wowed by it, and in fact, I feel, well, <clears throat> why not, let's, let's go the whole way, let's turn off everything, and see if there's any notable air moving off. You closer to that heater there? little bit. I'm pretty impressed. There's a very slight breeze back here. Okay, I'm going to turn everything back on. You able to turn that heater back on? I'll get the rest of the things. No, I'm impatient, so I'll do it for you. <laughs> you right. didn't want to mess up your shot, I assume. Very quickly. A lot of wind resistance, I assume. Maybe not quite as quickly as it implies at first. Okay. Reverse. 0.23. You have any comments on these little blades? Yeah, they're kind of cute. <laughs> you weren't here for the filming of the ones with the wicker blades in this shape. Otherwise, I'd ask your opinion compared to those. Okay. Medium. Oh, I forgot. We're supposed to do blender fan test. We didn't do that with the Fasco either. Because I think it was, if, if I'm not... Oh, that's what I get for trying to... Oh, that was, I bumped the blender fan into the fluorescent light. Wouldn't you know it? Even the 44-inch blades move it slightly. Very slowly. Eh? 
But yeah, it's it's not it's not letting up. It's still going. And it's very slow. Okay. Um Wait, nope, not yet. I thought I, was, I thought I was gonna say now is when I need you to take over camera duties, but not in fact yet. So, this is the Fasco four-speed control. Low, forward, turn the fan to high. 0.24, so it's about the same. <clears throat> I can sit in chairs now. Okay, medium low. 0.43. Medium high, 0.56, and then high. Okay. Are you able to take over camera duties? Certainly. Okay. Should be obvious it's not the original canopy, it's a Fasco canopy, which I think looks rather fetching on there. And we will try, I don't believe I tried it in the past, but why not today? We will try the Emerson four speed 4711 control. should start out in 4.18, slower yet than the factory low speed and the regular 4 speed control as would be expected. Okay, 0.31 for the 7. Point four five for the 11. And for reference, Hi. Okay. I'm not going to do the Evergo control unless you put in a request. Andy, do you have a request for the Evergo control? Nah, I don't. Okay. I don't think it was that impressive. With the... No, it rarely is. And we've done it with many stack motor fans, and it often gets the same results. But the solid state control should be interesting. Indeed. Turning that to the lowest setting. Not drawing anything. Did I not turn to the lowest setting? I did. Wait, I bet you that move started moving. I wasn't even looking at it and I could tell. Okay. Try to walk it back down. Okay, 0 0.05, 0 0.06. 0 0.07, which is where it started moving before. Yep, 0 0.07 is the magic number. <clears throat> okay. Take it up an eighth of a turn, takes us to 0.19, which is about the same as the low on the Emerson control. Another eighth of a turn takes us to 0.3. Pretty silent with the variable speed. I think we remember that from the last video. Another eighth of a turn takes us to 0.42. Another eighth of a turn takes us to 0.55. Yeah, the rustling of the blades is louder than the solid state buzz for reference. Okay, next up, four blades. I believe I've gotten to be an expert at switching them. Let's just see how quickly I can do it. Okay, you started with the time code at about 9.45 in the video. Okay. 
I'm gonna, it's going to take me a little bit longer with this fan than with some others because I'm trying to be very, very careful with these very, very fragile blades. I'm also trying very hard not to drop any screws. I'm just going to set the one blade we're not going to be using over here. Well, that trip across the attic is going to cut into his time, folks. It Let's is. see what he can do to come back. Putting screws in my mouth. That's my solution. Ten forty five, one minute elapsed. No fresher. Why do I have these screws in my mouth? I'm not going to need them. That's why, in case I drop one. It's over by, by over there by that steering column. I guess that's the advantage. I can drop two screws, and since we're losing a blade, I'm not hindered. And since I watched where that screw went, I do believe that is not a penalty, since I can pick it up. I don't think you were here for it. There was a day that I was filming videos and the same song was in my head for every video and it was terrible. Um, today's song is X Factor by Lauryn Hill, but it's not the current version. It's the it, it's not the, uh, the album version, it's a live version that she did with The Roots. You familiar with the Roots? Nope. They're a legendary hip hop band that's now the house band for the Tonight Show. Mm. So, prior to that, I think only like East Coast hip hop heads really knew them. But uh, they've gotten, gotten um, a nice. As, as a non hip hop head, in any case. Yeah, but and now they you know they do all the skits and the sketches and the stuff on the Tonight Show, so. You get to see things three, like the black Simon and Garfunkel. Three minutes elapsed. I'll have to see what my time was on the last Islander. This can be this can be a thing. Can can Dan beat his best time for for converting yeah. from five blades to four? Are all of them in the proper position? Because that's a thirty second penalty if one of them is off. They're not. They look good so far. Time? I think so. Three I think we're half. all in clock. It's hard to tell. It looks very, uh... No, they're in clock, aren't they? It's so hard to tell with these. Yeah. With these four... Nope, that's perfect. Three and a half minutes, we'll call it. Time. Okay. Let me find the screw before we get started. Because I, uh... Don't have that penalty hanging over me. Don't want that. No. I believe we're already on high. Medium low. Okay, what did I do wrong? Oh, this is not on. This should be factory low, 0.23. You should at least know who the roots are because you're because of NBC. That's the NBC's late show's house band. Do you know who Questlove is? No. Oh. You're not doing your station proud right now. 0.48 on the factory medium. Point six nine on the factory high. It actually draws slightly more current with 4 than it did with 5. That's interesting. I'm going to go back and see. I'll turn off. That Wonder fan is already off. Turn off this heater. What did I just do? I just pushed too many buttons. <clears throat> Have you been here for any videos during the summer? 
I don't think so. I typically turn everything off during the video, and it gets really, really hot, but then at least I get accurate measurements of air movement. Yeah, it surprisingly gives me a breeze all the way back there. It's not a, like, you know, it's not even as much as some of the stronger American-made fans, but it's, it's something. Yeah. So, off, reverse. All of my fan fleeces were dirty today, so I did do laundry before I came here. Ah, uh, of course. Reverse low, point two three. Regular viewers may recognize the orange fan fleece that has been with me for many years. I think I also have a blue one. It's too too cold. The brown one that's my favorite, that's ratty, and my wife wants me to throw it out, and I do not. It seems like it's a little bit slower in reverse, doesn't it? Yeah. But it's the same current drop, so it just must be the way the blades are contoured. Medium, 0.48. Yeah, the brown one isn't as warm as the orange one. Medium, 0.48. High, 0.69. And let's see if we pass the blender fan test. We don't appear to be. No. I'm feeling quite a breeze from it over here, but... Okay. So oh, wait, 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 oh, 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 what have we here? Well, it's a time delay. But then once it gets started, it almost seems like it's faster than it was with five. Unless that's my imagination. Yeah, I think you're right. It's pretty impressive given that this is a 44-inch fan. Yeah. And so the blender fan is that much further away. Okay. Off. Forward. Fast go four speed control low. 0.23. I'm going to go through this quickly since these are pretty similar to the factory speeds. Medium low. 0.42. Medium high. 0.55. High, 0.69, off, <clears throat> apparently I wrapped up the Emerson control like we were done for the night, I don't know why I did that, it does help keep things tidy, but... This is the Emerson 4711 control. I'm going to plug it in and it's going to start on low, which is the 4. Okay, we'll go through this one quickly as well. 7. Current draw is 0 0.31. 11. Current draw is 0.45, which if memory serves is the same as the factory medium speed. High for reference. And the piece de resistance, the infinitely variable solid state control. We are at point zero six. Point zero seven. Zero seven. Yep. That's our takeoff speed. Yeah. That's all it needs to start on low is point point zero seven. Which uh, how good are you at math in your head? Multiply that by one hundred and twenty. Point zero seven times one hundred and twenty. Yeah, now I can do that in my head. Okay. Well, if it was that's let's see. Round it up to point one oh, and you can move the decimal. Yeah, then that would be... So it's it's roughly around a watt, isn't it? That it's drawing to do this? Yeah. Okay. 
eighth of a turn takes us to 0.17. Another eighth of a turn takes us to 0.31. Another eighth of a turn takes us to 0.43. Another eighth of a turn takes us to 0.54. I love how silent that is with the solid state control. You can do it. You can do like a mass install of these in a restaurant on a solid state control. Hi for reference. And that's it for the 44-inch Islander. So uh, that was fun. Um, got more stuff to show you. Thanks for watching.